What's up, everyone? Welcome to Mikey's boardroom. I'm Mikey. I'm Krista. And this is our boardroom. Tonight, we're going to review Bullet. Bullet is a game for one to four players where you are drawing tokens. I got a spider web on my hand. <laughs> You're drawing tokens out of a bag, and the tokens all have a color and a number on it. So you match it up with the color, and then whatever number it is between one and four, that's how many empty spaces you go down in that row. And you also have pattern cards. <laughs> which are going to allow you to get rid of bullets in your sight, and you basically don't want the bullets to move down and take away your life. And if you get hit four times, for most characters, some characters have less life, uh, but if you get hit a certain amount of times, then you lose. It's very quick, pretty fun. Um, but yeah, we'll dive into our pros and our cons and just some, some other thoughts about it and sort of let you know what we think. Anything to add to that? No, nope. you nailed it. <laughs> All right, um, so let's just jump straight into it with the, the pros. So things we liked about it. Do you have any that you want to say first? It's fast. That is my first point as well. Is it? The game length. It <laughs> yeah. is a fast, fun game. So yeah. uh, I like shorter games as well as longer games, but mm -hmm. you know, I, I really like fun, shorter games because yeah. we're parents, we got kids, uh, we can't always sit down and play a three, four hour game. So I really like the game length. Uh, yeah. um, it's you use a timer in it. Um, which could be something that you might not yeah. like, but we were weary at first. Yeah, we but were weary of the time. We realized but we liked it. Yeah, it definitely made it better. But <laughs> yeah. I would say it's like 15, 20 minute yeah. game on average. So, mm -hmm. um, game length definitely a positive for me. Yeah, me too. Anything else you want to add? You see if you can take away all my points before I say them. <laughs> um, I like how it's an even playing field. Okay. Um, I feel like there's maybe like one or two people that aren't very good, but uh -huh. ultimately it's pretty. I was going to say that even. my positive is that all the characters feel unique. Yeah. So they all have every, I think there's like eight characters or so, um, but they all have a, a certain special power that, mm -hmm. that they can use to help clear bullets out of their sight. Yeah. And they all feel different. They all feel unique. And some might be a little bit better than others, yeah. but overall they're, they're, they're fun to use. I think I'd you say. could have some fun pairing them. Like if yeah. we really wanted to get into this, I think mm -hmm. you could pair them and fight pretty well. Yeah, go against each other. Yeah. Game. yeah. Which Definitely. I just was always very ill. <laughs> yeah, she was always very ill. I tried a different, a few, I, I tried all yeah. of them, but... Um, In order to record, I had to be the same person <laughs> over and over again. And I just wanted to try all of them. <laughs> um, yeah, so she like Meryl. Meryl definitely seemed really good. She's bomb. Um, she beat me all the time, but uh, I struggle with this game, so I could be why. <laughs> um, anything else? You're on a roll. Keep it Keep it going. Mm. I like the artwork. It's pretty It's pretty great. It's like anime. Artwork's really cool. I like the artwork a lot. Definitely cool artwork. It's got that anime style. Yeah. I don't know. Let me think if I can think of anything. Okay, like well, while you think, I will Ooh, say I that. like when we tie. I like the... What's it called? What do you mean when we tie? When we oh, tie sudden at the death? End. Sudden death. That's fun. Sudden death. Because it's complete we, luck. When we both much. lose on the same yeah. round, then we go into sudden death. Yeah, I like that fun. too. It's the first one to get hit loses. Yeah, so. it's a fun way to end it's it. It's fun, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> Um, I was going to say that using a big positive for me is using the pattern cards to clear bullets. That puzzle of trying to line up the bullets and make them make them into that exact pattern that you need on your card to get rid of them. That's really fun. See, I don't like that, uh -huh. but that's just because I suck at that. Knowing there's a timer going, I just can't, I can't say put that's, it together. <laughs> that's pretty much the game is <laughs> trying to clear those bullets if you don't like that. No, I mean, like, like it's good. It's really just because I feel, like, panicked. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it definitely feels like you're yeah. like you're dodging bullets. Yeah, <laughs> but like that, they're good though. It's just because I feel panicked. <laughs> um, another positive for me is I really like the timer, um, which might be a negative for you if you're not into timers. Yeah. But it adds we, an element. When we to first it. started playing, we didn't use the timer at all. Yeah. Um, we were just kind of like mm -hmm. going at our own pace, and the game would take. Forty-five yeah. minutes sometimes. Yeah. Um, trying to like, I was scrutinizing every single card, like trying to maximize yeah. the best decision possible to make that pattern to clear those bullets. Mm -hmm. But when you got three minutes on the round, you're just like, I gotta draw bullets, yeah. and I got it. Like it really adds the mistakes yeah. and like the the having to do it quick. Yeah. Adds to it because if somebody's yeah, shooting bullets a, at you, element, yeah. is it gonna be fast or slow that yeah. you have to dodge it? Yeah, so. we definitely take it that way yeah. over no timer yeah exactly like timer sure. definitely adds makes yeah. it better i think it makes it more even too because when we weren't using a timer i just beat you yeah. every single time i'm just better at this type of a thing mm -hmm. but sure. <laughs> with the timer i didn't have time to like puzzle it all together yeah. i just had to like you just had to go, go you just got to go with it exactly yeah. so the mistakes kind of make it part of the yeah, fun and it does. and like when you're trying really hard to get the bullets in a certain way and then your timer goes off mm -hmm. and, and you're like ah yeah um it's just i don't know it just adds a lot of fun yeah. in my opinion i think so too um, another thing I really liked is that when you do clear bullets, 
using your pattern cards is that those bullets go to the next to the person's uh, board the next round. So you put them all in this little area, and then they have to draw a certain amount of bullets out of the main bag after the round is over. And then they also have to throw in all the bullets that you cleared from the previous round. So that's mm. really, really fun. Um, just like feels satisfying. It's yeah, like that's I true. Cleared, I like piling them it's up. It's like right? I, when you do well and you clear all your bullets, yeah. you also screw over the person yeah. to your left or, or right or whatever. Yeah. Um, that is fun. Because you're adding sure. all those bullets to their incoming. So, and yeah. likewise, when you do bad and you just have bullets everywhere, you look over and you've only given them like three. Yeah. And meanwhile, she's given me 10 <laughs> every single round. And <laughs> so, like, that's just like it just adds a lot of, a lot of, um, Kind of like a take bat, if you will. Or yeah, something. it does. Because you're um, not really involved with each other during the game. That's like pretty much the only. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So that leads into my other one. Perfect. It's like we okay. reverse this. <laughs> um, I was going to say that I really like the player interaction in this game. And I really like it. So you don't have to talk to me? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Let me let me expand. I like the player interaction because it's a it's like one of those games where you're, you're both doing your thing simultaneously. Mm-hmm. So we start the timer and she's doing her thing and I'm doing mine until mm-hmm. the round is over. And most most of those games, um, I'm not a big fan of that type of gameplay because I yeah. want to play with. Yeah. You know, I want to play with her and like this could be fun and what I'm doing is fun. But if we're not really interacting at all mm-hmm. and we're just both doing our thing. Um, it's just less fun in my opinion yeah, to me. Yeah, doesn't feel like we're spending um, a night together. Exactly. To me, it's not what I look for. But this yeah. has that where you're kind of doing your own thing. And then um, it also has interaction because when the round's over, you're like, oh my gosh. And you look at all the bullets you have and you look at this. You're like, <laughs> yeah. how are you? Like, what are we going to do? So the yeah. timer kind of plays into that whole yeah. interaction thing as well. Um, yeah. It's just for what it, for a game where you're doing your own thing and they're doing their thing, there is still really strong player yeah. interaction. I think that's I think that's awesome. I really yeah. like yeah, that. Yeah, we were worried about that when exactly, we first started yeah. playing the game. There's like a Yeah. Another thing I really, really like is um, all the power up tokens. So there's also these tokens that you get after you complete a round. And so every character has a certain amount of different power ups on their on their power up board. And every all of the characters have different ones and also sort of similar ones as well. They all basically manipulate bullets and do things. Um, to change the bolts around on the board but certain characters do you know extra things as well so like this one can move a bullet in any direction whereas some characters can only move bullets down or to the side they can't move them up Um, hers she can move her token around to clear extra bullets um, Mm -hmm. through her character's ability and then on top of the ones that are on that board you get these power-up tokens and they do a number of different things like clear a bullet any bullet in your sight or move a bullet to any space or draw a pattern card, um, just different things that you can get after the round is over and put on your board as a little extra something to do mm-hmm. to help you kind of solve this puzzle of how I'm going to get these bolts off my board yeah. and put them onto onto your board. And you definitely use them. And you definitely use them, As you get them, more yes. and more, like, you, you go up. <laughs> definitely use them. I, like, I use them every single time yeah. also. I almost never go through a round without spending yeah. that power-up token I got that round. Maybe that's why I'm terrible. Maybe I should be Yeah, I that. save all mine and use them at the end when, like, okay. my site's just okay. packed. I guess that's why I'm terrible. <laughs> no, I'm just bad not. at this game. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's another thing I really, really like. It's just everything just, it just always feels sort of fresh. And there's just always, uh, there's a lot of tools that you have to kind of solve this puzzle. And mm-hmm. it's good because this puzzle is really hard. Yeah. <laughs> Any other positives before I move on to my negatives? I don't know. Let me take a quick drink. I don't know. Okay, so... We kind of already talked about this, and I don't have a lot of cons in this game, a lot of things Mm -hmm. I didn't like, but the simultaneous play is my biggest con about it. Yeah. Um, But like I just said, it didn't really negatively affect it. Um, It's just not the type of game that I play. So. Yeah. So that's, that's... If it was a long game, I think I would agree. But it's such a short game. Exactly. It doesn't bother me. It's such a quick game that, and like we said, the whole throwing bullets to the next person um, really makes it so that... We yeah. are interacting. And I love it after the round when you look up and you look over at mine and you're like, how did you clear so many? Exactly. Like, I love that. I, I have <laughs> I love bullets everywhere <laughs> and she has her it completely cleared out every time. So, <laughs> No, not every time. <laughs> um, another thing for me is I wish that there, I don't know how they would balance this or, I mean, they probably, they probably thought of something like this and then ended up scrapping it because it would just not really work. Um, but I kind of wish there was a, like a super ability that each person would work towards and then you could clear like a massive amount of bullets in one go. That might just be me. It's probably more than you. But, but. The, the, like it's fun clearing bullets using your cards. But the most that I've ever cleared in one go is four bullets. 
and like that feels really good. Maybe not even, maybe not even four, maybe three. Um, like that feels awesome when you clear that many, mm-hmm. but I kind of wish that there was like a super that it would take, you know, you have to play because we would usually play what, like four or five rounds before we lose. Yeah. Well, uh, something that you have to make it to like six, seven rounds. And then like you've somehow built up something to use a super ability that's going to clear like a massive chunk of bullets right out of the, the center. I can see the other. Yeah, um, like I said, I, I don't know that. how it would be balanced. I don't know if it would even work. They might have thought of that and had to yeah. scrap it. Um, but just personally, like I, I kind of wish there was something that every once in a while yeah. I could just take a take a giant chunk of bullets out of the center and just give them to you. Um, I so see. I see. The it's not really a con, that. I guess. It's more just like sort of a, a secondary thought. I don't know. That, that sounds stressful to me because you're already balancing <laughs> so much in a round yeah. to like then be thinking about something you're working towards. But I see that. Like I yeah. totally get it. It makes sense. Yeah. I agree. That'd probably make it better. It just sounds stressful. Yeah. It, pro- <laughs> it might not make it better. Like it, if, if they added that, it might just be like, this is stupid. <laughs> or we might never get to it because... This isn't a con, but leading into the other thoughts, did you have any other cons to add first before I move into just secondary thoughts about the game? Um, I have a con, oh, oh, and it has yeah. to do kind of what I what I said before Throw about the, the patterns. I think the reason I don't like them is because they're really hard to see. Like, it's hard for me, like, when I'm looking at it playing, it's like, because I don't have any on here, but some of them have it where you, it has to be empty below it. Okay, and yeah. so it's hard trying to, like, figure out, like, like just seeing it is hard. Yes, the it. visual puzzle yeah. of looking at your pattern and then looking at yeah. your board and trying to match... Everything as it shows in here, it's yeah. definitely like kind of confusing. I, I'm sure there are people who like are very good at visual yeah. puzzles and they're just like, oh, and yeah. they can do it, but that's neither of us, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> it's mainly the ones where like nothing can be below it because they're circles with like dashes. Exactly. So it's just confusing yeah, because exactly. it just looks like another circle. <laughs> <laughs> do you confuse yourself? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. Um, yeah, any, yeah. Any other negatives? No, I think that's it, really. It's okay. pretty good. Game. My only other thought, it's not a negative because it's 100% me, but this game is hard. It's hard. Like, I struggle with it because of what we just talked about, um, because of just, like, sometimes you just have bad luck and you draw four reds in a row and you didn't clear any and then yes. you get hit. So sometimes it's yeah. poor luck. Sometimes it's because I'm... I'm, I'm not good at this game sometimes it's because i'm trying too hard to arrange the bullets and the timer goes off yeah whatever it is it's just a hard game yeah, now it makes hard. it better because it's not Easy. it's not <laughs> no no it's well, not yeah <laughs> it's not long so the fact that it's short like it's hard but it's over quick and yeah you know we can play two or three yeah. this game two or three four times yeah. um if we want it's like as long as as long as you're okay playing a game that's hard and you're going to, like, lose quickly, at least if you're me and you have the same struggles I yeah. do, um, like, I lose and I lose quick. <laughs> and sometimes we'll do sudden death. Uh, but for the most part, I don't, I think there's only one time we played this that I actually legitimately beat you without having to go into sudden death. Yeah, I think um, so. So it's just, it's just a hard game <laughs> for me. Yeah. <laughs> I struggle with all of it. It is but, a tough game. But I that agree. might be des- by design, too. They might yeah. want to just, like, that might be for everybody, and they're just, because, they, yeah. like, they're throwing bullets at you, and you have to do your yeah. best. The um, the round marker goes up to, what, eight rounds, and I think the most we've done is five mm. that we've completed. No, so. we went up here one time okay. once. Okay, so we have that gotten up there, so maybe that is by design, then. Yeah. Um, but It's and, hard. And maybe we'd get better if we just kept, kept, like I'm sure we would get better if we kept playing. I got better because I just kept playing with yeah, her every time, yeah. and I learned how to use yeah, her exactly. ability. Maybe, um, but yeah, that was my only other thought: is that it's just hard, and that might hard. just be me. But it's but fun. I, like, I enjoy I like it. It's not challenge. a negative because it's still really fun. Yeah. Um, but it's definitely hard. It's hard for sure. <laughs> um, yeah. So that's all I really had. Um, for the most part, I, I really like this game. Okay. So let's give Let's give scores. So do you want scores to... are hard for me because I always forget like what. <laughs> okay, so a one. Number. A five. Well, let me tell you how I feel about it, and you can tell me which number that is. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Does that work better? Sure. <laughs> so this is a game where I'd be fine keeping it on our shelf, and okay. if you ever wanted to play it, I would say yeah, but I don't know if I'd ever ask. Okay. But I'd bring it on a trip, and I'd play it. Okay. I Does would that say that. Sense? I would say that's a three. A three? Okay. Three, maybe a four. It's a solid game. To me, four and five stay in our collection. Uh-huh. Five, I wouldn't want to get rid of fives it. Fives are the best, so maybe four. Four and five stay in the collection, like, no questions about, or stay mm-hmm. in the collection, no questions about it. Um, fives are the best of the best. Threes are, are good games. I like them, but, you know, they might, we might get rid of it. We might keep it. Mm-hmm. It just sort of depends on the game and how we, how much we play it. Um, twos are games that I don't like just because of my personal preference. And ones are just straight up bad games. Either they're poorly made or, or they're broken in some mm-hmm. way. Um, so, yeah, it sounds like you like, you would say I this do like four. this game. There's not a whole lot wrong with yeah. it. It's I, fun. It's quick. I would definitely give it a four as well. 
I, d I don't want to yeah. get rid of it. I would like just because of the, how short it is and then also yeah. how fun it still is at being that length. Yeah. This is a game that I definitely want to keep yeah. and continue to play. I, um, I wouldn't say it's a five out of five no. um, for me, but no. it's definitely a four. Definitely one yeah. I don't want to get rid of. It's a solid game. Um, just all around fun. And like there's a, this is a review solely on based solely on the like the head-to-head -head mode or whatever oh yeah imagine how crazy it gets with like multiple people i'm gonna say there's multiple people <laughs> there's also a cooperative mode there's a solo mode um so we haven't even you know oh, that's fun we haven't we haven't dived dove in dove dived into it we haven't dived into those yet <laughs> <laughs> um, we just know. played the, the standard game mode, and that's yeah, been enough oh, so fun. far. We'll but have to try, we'll have to try it out yeah. and maybe put our review of the cooperative mode and stuff yeah. like that. Um, yeah, so that's that's it. Okay. Four fours across the board. That's a good yeah, one. Yeah, it's a good game. I'm I don't give out fours. Yeah, really she like... is. She's very hard to please <laughs> with games. So, so four is, is a good rating from her. It's a good game. And um, yeah, it's a good rating all around. Okay, so that's it. So thank you so much for popping in. Uh, I always say popping in. <laughs> I, I, you should have like popcorn. I edited it and I said pop in like three or four times within within the span of like two minutes in one of the videos. And I was like, why am I saying pop in? I never say pop in ever because it's just like a nervous. Do you cringe when you like edit? <laughs> sometimes. Sometimes I definitely cringe. Mostly at you though. Yeah, I'm not surprised. <laughs> um, yeah, so anyways, like I was saying, thanks for popping in. <laughs> um, you can check out our playthrough I'll put it down in the description we have an unboxing too but I don't know why you'd want to watch that um, so yeah do you want to say anything? you look like you are about to say something why is it blinking? I don't know hopefully it's still good okay. that was but, what I was thinking anyways okay. uh, comment like subscribe all that jazz you know all that um, and just check out our other videos thank you we appreciate you go out there be kind to somebody um, everybody can use a little more kindness mm -hmm. and have a, have a great rest of your day. It's so hot out here. Put the correct, the correct color and then you take them down however many spaces, um, how many open spaces. Let's just start over. Uh, basically you draw the token out of the bag you match it with the color on the row. You go down the open number of spots, however many spaces it says. How do I say this? Why is it so awkward to say?